phenol or fractional excel nitric oxide test. This is a test to measure the level of nitric oxide gas in excel sample of patient's breath. By doing this phenol test, we can tell how much lung inflammation is present and how well and help steroid or suppressing this inflammation. So what is nitric oxide? Nitric oxide is a gas produced throughout the body, including in the lung, to fight inflammation and relax tight muscles. So why should phenol test be done? It is important test in investigating the cause of respiratory symptoms. High level of nitric oxide in breath can mean that airways are inflamed, one sign of asthma. It can also help to predict whether or not steroid medication, which decreases uh, inflammation are likely to be helpful. It can guide us whether to step down or step up or discontinue anti-inflammatory medication. It also assists in the evaluations of adherence of anti-inflammatory medications. So how nitric oxide is being measured? So we use a portable small device called NEOX. This machine is good for both adults and children, and patient has to produce a 10 second of exhalation of breath with a pressure of 10 to 20 centimeters of water in order to maintain a stable flow rate of 50 ml per second. So this uh, machine has a electrochemical sensor which evaluates the final three seconds of exhalation which measures the level of nitric oxide, oxide in parts per billion, PPB. So the procedure to get accurate measurement, this test is different from most lung function tests. Patient needs to blow out slowly and steadily, not hard and fast. So we ask the patient to breathe in deeply and slowly till the lungs are full and then exhale slowly and steadily for about 10 seconds. So there are some factors that affecting phenol results. These factors are non-disease non related factors, for example, diet, smoking, coffee drinking, leafy green vegetables, anti-inflammatory medication, allergen exposure, respiratory viral infection, measurement technique, spirometry. So we should, so should not be done performed first. During bronchodilation, phenol could increase. During bronchoconstriction, phenol decreases. So it's mandatory to correctly interpret phenol result in patients, in each patient. So these are the things that we ask the patient to avoid one hour prior to the test. For interpretations, phenol level of less than 25 ppb is normal for adults. For children, less than 20 is normal. Phenol of 25 to 50 for adults is elevated. So we have to take in consideration all those factors. More than 50 is high. And this is most likely connected with air, airway isnophilic inflammation. So in conclusion, phenol test is a non-invasive cheap, quick, easy to assess airway inflammation, and it is uh, has a series of advantages in the management of asthma for both adults and children. So these advantages are A, 
in the diagnostic process in which, for example, a pheno is high, so there is that with consistent symptoms, so we suspect asthma. Second, in the assessment of response to inhaled corticosteroid treatment, patient with high pheno and in, has an increased probability to improve after having starting inhaled corticosteroid. Number C, in the evaluations of adherence of inhaled corticosteroid, non-adherent patients will have high pheno even despite the giving the treatment. And finally, number letter D, in severe asthma, pheno has, pheno is used as a biomarker for biological treatment. So mostly they have good response to biological treatment. Okay, so this is the pheno device. It's called Neox. It has a cap on top. So we'll put the filter. Now it is ready for our patient. So we'll ask the patient to take a slow deep breath in all the way till the lungs are completely full and slowly out, 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 out. Okay? Please. So now, you can take a deep breath, put it in your mouth. Big, 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 And push. Push, 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 more, 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 push, more, push, more. You have to keep it in the middle. Push, 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 push. Very good, very good, very good, very good, very good, very good. Keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing. Excellent. Okay, so we'll get the result in a minute. Okay, so he got 85, which is above 50, which is high. So patient might have inflamed airways.